All right, so a great day to go to the park. It was absolutely beautiful out there. Take a right. look at this sunset behind me. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. Gorgeous. Right? It is beautiful, yes, and you know, temperatures, uh, we felt the warm-up, numbers in the mid-70s, and we're going to continue that trend up for several days, actually, so I think you'll be a little surprised by the extended outlook. Uh, but first, there's a live look at Santa Monica, beautiful sunset tonight. Uh, those days continue to get longer and longer, and uh, numbers still in the 70s, low 70s for some areas at the 5 o'clock hour. 70 degrees right now for Woodland Hills, we have 64 right now in Malibu, 67 for down downtown 68 degrees in Burbank some low 70s uh, for Cypress out in Orange County we have low 70s in Anaheim as well as your Belinda 70 degrees in Corona as well as Riverside 61 in Yukaipa and 39 degrees in Big Bear City uh, there's a check of our satellite radar so mostly clear skies allowing for plenty of warming today we're going to continue that trend tomorrow is actually going to be even nicer uh, winds uh, you know that's really been the big story these last several days that uh, things have kind of calmed down a bit and we have no wind advisories in place at the moment. However, as we head into tomorrow, we're going to see those winds ramp up once again, continuing into Monday. So here's a look at Sunday late morning. We're starting to see a lot of those gusts in that 30 mile per hour range out through places like Ventura County, strong through the San Fernando Valley and into the Coachella Valley. We're still going to see gusty conditions into the afternoon hours and even into the early part of Monday, and then finally subsiding by later into Monday. Monday. So we're going to see a wind advisory going into effect early Sunday, continuing through two o'clock on Monday for a lot of our area. That includes our mountains, a lot of our valleys, including the San Fernando, Santa Clarita Valley into parts of Orange County. And of course, the Inland Empire gusts will be nearing 40, even close to 50 miles per hour. So once again, those potentially damaging winds, we could be talking down trees and down power lines. Once again, we are looking at those strong winds. We're also looking at high pressure moving in and dominating our weather pattern for several days. So for the entire upcoming work week, we're going to be talking well above average temperatures, not just in the 70s, but well into the 80s as well. So it is going to be feeling like spring, even borderline summertime next uh, week. Here's a look at numbers. We'll already start to see a few 80s popping up in places like Van Nuys, Santa Ana, Palm Springs at 79 degrees. And the warming trend continues as we head into next week with mid 80s by Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, continuing hot into next weekend as well. Here's a look at the Inland Empire also getting into the low 80s by late next week, the high desert in the 60s and in the mid 70s and plenty of 50s across our mountains. I'll send it back to you guys. Got your phone handy? Of course you do. Scan this right here. Download the CBS LA app. And just like that, you're connected to all the best local news and videos. Now, if only everything were this easy.